What's going on everybody? My name is Mr. Relics. Welcome back to the YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how you can resolve the issue of having trucks or cars or any other vehicle in your server despawn every time you restart the server. Now this is an issue that's plagued me for a really long time. I finally figured it out and I thought I'd share it with everyone here. We're going to try and get this video done in under two minutes so we're not going to be dragging this out at all. So first go to your Nitrado dashboard. Log in and go to this screen. Well, actually, it'll be dashboard, this screen. We're going to want to go to file browser. We're going to go into the missions folder. So it might be PS, might be Xbox view, might be PC. We're going to go to Daisy offline. And we're going to go to the DB folder. Now we're going to head to the events.xml because this is where all the magic happens. And here is where we're going to search for the specific vehicle we want to make sure doesn't despawn when the, when the server restarts. For me, it's the M3 truck, so I'm just going to do a control F, do a truck, and here we go. A vehicle truck 01 is the variant for M3. And here underneath where children is, is where the magic happens. Now, by default, it might be really, really high. So let's just put it back to where it would have normally been. Default max 40, minimum 40. It might be different for you, but for me, this is what it was. Now, this was the entire reason why the server, why the trucks weren't were despawning when the server restarted. What what actually has to happen is you need to set this to one, and you can do this for every instance of vehicles. So I've got the truck trader in mind. So as you can see, max one, min one. We've got the truck event two. I've also got uh, off-road hatchbacks like sedans, things like that. All of the vehicles. Make sure in the children that the max is one and the min is one for all variant types. If it's any higher than that, the server is going to try and spawn in multiple of whatever vehicle it is you had, and it's going to poo itself, and it's not going to spawn in any truck. So therefore, will despawn. Now, other trucks will spawn in the areas that you have custom spawns for, but the ones that you already have will not spawn in. That is how you fix it. Quick and easy and it will save you a massive headache. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, give me a like, hit subscribe, and I will see you in another one.